Today we will discuss the water cycle. It all starts when the sun shines brightly and heat up the water. The water changes into water vapor and evaporates. In the heat of the sun, plants and soil also lose water in the form of water vapor. This process is called transpiration. As the water vapors from land and sea rise up in the air, they lose their heat and cools down in form of little water droplets and form clouds. This is called condensation. As the clouds get heavier, more water vapor condenses, the tiny water droplets form bigger droplets and fall back to the earth's surface as rain. The water that falls as rain goes back to the land, seas, rivers, lakes and oceans. When the sun come up again, the water evaporates again, hence the cycle repeats. The water cycle is the continuous movement of water from the earth's surface to the air and back to the earth's surface again. It involves changes in the state of water through evaporation and condensation. The water cycle is important because it makes sure that water on the earth will not run out and living things have a constant supply of fresh water. This brings us to the end of the video. If you have any queries you can write to us at the studypod01 at gmail.com.